Well, hello everyone, and you know, I have a feeling there's been too much sanity going on on my channel recently. It's a bad, bad thing. So, I've enlisted the help of, quite frankly, the most wonderfully insane person I've ever met. Say hello, April. Hello. <laughs> And we're gonna. We thought, you know, what we need, okay, is we need a, a, a subtle game, a dignified game, <laughs> a game that's gonna make people stop and think, and perhaps, you know, write little sonnets. <laughs> then we decided to play this one instead. Yeah, I'm this so is... excited. <laughs> <laughs> this is Akiba's trip or Akiba strip, <laughs> as you can, depending on how you want to pronounce that. Undead and undressed. The storyline is mad. The storyline is you are tasked with finding the undead in the streets and exposing them to sunlight the only way you know how, by beating <laughs> them up and tearing their clothes off. It's, it's ridiculous. <laughs> and, and, and fortunately, it's got some uh, voice bits in, which actually, thinking about it, why don't we do them? Yeah. Um, and don't worry, this game is safe for work. Just for clarification. Yes. <laughs> yes. Um, unless unless you work for somebody who is uh, totally a, a, um, uh, allergic to underwear, you'll be perfectly all right. <laughs> oh. So, you know, oh. please carry on. You can change the cell phone background. Yeah, I had a look at that. We don't have any yet. Oh, crap. We got to win some. Yeah. No. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> Uh, and to add insult to injury, I shall be playing this using a an Xbox controller. I am absolutely pants with Xbox controllers. You can do it. So, oh, I can do it. I just don't want to. <laughs> you can do right. anything. <laughs> Let's start a game, shall we? Yay! Let's go for easy. Yeah, just for fun, these. Yeah. We're just doing this for laughs, not to be tough, not to be good. <laughs> Which is probably a good thing, really, isn't it? Yes. Right. To right. I'm not going to change any of the names, I think. So we only have the one model. And why we picked that one, I don't know. And... <laughs> hey! Yeah, that's right. <laughs> we can we can basically intimidate the vampires by being like, Hey, I can walk around without a shirt. <laughs> yeah. And say, Hey, I'm brave enough to wear these boxes. <laughs> yes, yeah, so uh, that's... Dress him up at the moment. Uh, there we go. Oh, we have so many choices. Do we have? Yeah, yeah. Just, just the one set of uh, skimps. Okay. Mm. <laughs> okay, I'm so excited. I'm sorry. Okay, actually, there's, there's more. There's more. There's much, much more. Uh, change character. That one there. Okay, there we go. And we have Nana, the little sister. That's and weird. of course. Nope. Yeah. She needs to wear her skirt. <laughs> yeah, is that is that okay in all okay, I just wanted to do this one it's this is nothing nothing titillish about that. It's it's I just wanted to show you this is the level of nudity involved in the game. That's yep, honestly and completely my only reason for doing it. Okay. That's that's you know, it's like a bikini. Yeah. So she the the girls, um quite surprisingly, um have uh, changes of clothes, but the boys don't. Oh, that's lame. Yeah, so we can change. Yeah, Madam Whiplash up there. Huh. Actually, hmm. I'm gonna be honest. The colours look good on her. Yeah. But. Uh... Should change and her course, shoe colour. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So let's uh, let's let's go let's go for dark Shizuku, shall we? Um... Yep. There you go. Yeah, perfect. Mm. Like a cat's birthday. <laughs> I haven't heard that one in so long. Hey. I know, right? <laughs> Never. And of course, there's the matching underwear as well. There we go. There That's we go. the important one, right? Who else yes, because they rip here? off your clothes too. Yes. And Rin Tokikazi. <laughs> um, yep. And moving straight back <laughs> to the Oh, that and... was like. Uh... Like Chio. There's the girl next door. Yep. And 
I think as we get, I think we're gonna get clothes. The maid, of course. Did you see the boob jiggle? Oh yes. Wiggle it, wiggle it back and forth. That's hilarious. Oh god, boobs don't move like that. <laughs> Game designers, boobs don't move like that. <laughs> do you know? Do you know there are actually games designed courses now on boob boob physics? Mm-hmm. Yep, yeah. I'm aware. <laughs> <laughs> and oh, here we go. Here's the one. Is all business. Yep. She doesn't have time for a man, but she really wants love. Yeah, and a huge amount of jiggle there. Oh my god. Uh, can we just carry on here for the next 20 minutes? <laughs> I actually, that's why I can't wear blazers sort of cinched at the waist because my boobs get kind of crazy like that. It's annoying. Wait a sec, there's an option here that's expository. Um, if you're under the age of 13, please look away now. <laughs> okay, right, that was Purple's a waste better. <laughs> okay. Purple is better, I've got to be honest with you there. Yes, you're right. And back to Nanashi. Uh, all right. I think what we'll do, okay, is we might actually redress these guys from time to time if we have the option to do it. Yeah. And let's be honest with you. We're going to have the option to do it. That's the best part. Oh, yes. Let's get into this, <laughs> shall we? Yes. Like, basically, the point of playing The Sims is, yes. you know, just, just doing stuff with them until you can level them up. Mm. Uh, or occasionally send them swimming and then remove the ladder. Yes. <laughs> Except now they can get out. Uh, not when I have the turrets in place, they can't. <laughs> <sighs> oh no, it's a train. <laughs> Akihabara, Akiba for short. The town's seen it all, from Japanese post to Japan's post-war reconstruction to the economic bubblegum crisis of the 80s. Now, with the yen soaring above the dollar and deflation hitting the market like a ton of bricks, Akiba has found itself booming like never before. Absorbing a wide cutting edge of the there. In essence, it's become a microcosm <laughs> of Japanese society, always on the cutting edge of progress. And the, uh, the little something that says, "We're going to get, we're going to get, how are you going to get, we're going to get it." I hear there's a long-established maid cafe somewhere with a secret menu. If you order from it, well, okay. let's just say you get some real fan service <laughs> with chips. Yeah, and what about that hacker group? Oh, don't worry about them. I heard the men who keep their virginity past the age 30 turn into fairies. Oh, I've heard that too. <laughs> uh, it's all observed, contrived, immature, and scrolling way too fast. <laughs> all such obvious nonsense, and yet... I don't know, there's some part of me that can't help but get caught up in this, or indeed read fast enough. Some part of me that, that hangs on to every word, that finds it suspicious. There's just so many stories. <laughs> and if you fish for gossip, this is what you'll inevitably hear. <laughs> that is just booking it. Yes, I, I, I think those, 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 uh, those, those sentences were in a hurry to get home for dinner. <laughs> oh, I want dinner. Hmm, I want another one. Yep, second it's dinner. Mid, it's midnight. I shouldn't. So it'd be twelve Z's. Mm, yes, you've been hanging out to too many hobbits. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Morning already. Let me just sleep a little longer. Damn, somebody redecorated my bedroom while I was asleep. <laughs> well, well, it seems you've finally come around. Huh? <laughs> this, there's a sort of Shimbagami Tensei feel to this, isn't there? Yes, definitely. I believe congratulations are in order. You've officially passed the compatibility exam and are now ready to begin your life anew. Nurse, pass me the straw. <laughs> As a synthesizer. It's a synthesizer. Synthesizer. Yes, I've been struggling with that, trying to work out how to pronounce that all day. Synthesizer. Like hipster. <laughs> synthesizer. I should have read that line. <laughs> uh, whoops. Ellipsis. Ellipsis! <laughs> Am I strapped to a table? That's Damn, a that hasn't happened in weeks. <laughs> that is a dumb question, Nanashi. <laughs> <laughs> How'd I get here? I was, I was headed to a job interview for some part-time gig that was supposed to pay in rare figurines. <laughs> what but <doctor>? what? <laughs> yeah. But what happened after the interview? I can't remember. 
Damn me and my poor alcohol tolerance. <laughs> now, now, try to stay calm. You'll just ruin the flavor of the blood. <laughs> you did sign the contract. Sorry. The contract, <laughs> didn't you? Contract? No, the contract. <laughs> I, I guess I signed something, but let's have a look at it, shall we? Pertaining to the experiments and business affairs of the organization, the signee. That's you. Oh, as he said. Ah, that's you. Does hereby agree to faithfully and willingly cooperate and participate in all assigned activities without objection. And you said you'd come with me. For lunch. <laughs> As compensation, the organization agrees to remit rare and valuable character goods, figurines, and books per the signee's wishes. Really? They're rather shady terms. It's a wonder you ever endorse such a document. <laughs> okay, I thought it was a standard job contact. Whatever, just give me my figurines. Nobody ever reads the fine print. That's kind of, that's pretty honest. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm actually tempted to go with the middle one, to be honest with you. Sure. Should we? Yeah. yeah. Well now, aren't we feisty? A healthy attitude, though, for what lies ahead. Uh... Sorry, was that sinister enough? Shall I try it again? Mm -hmm. A healthy attitude for what lies ahead. <laughs> I love his crooked little grin. <laughs> this is great, isn't it? <laughs> I just love the, uh, the wonderful juxtaposition between the art styles here. Yeah. Yeah, you got Shin Rigami Tensei in the background and then magical uh, magical diaries at the front. It's brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Either way, fortune has smiled upon you today as you are the only one for whom this experiment succeeded. Yes, yeah. we cut your arms and legs off and said if you can run through the city playing the trumpet, we'll let you go. <laughs> you more than any other overflow with desire. Damn, put it back in your trousers. <laughs> your attachment to physical objects, I said put it back in your trousers, <laughs> is stronger than I've ever seen before. <laughs> the others simply couldn't measure up. Yes, okay, seriously, put it back in your trousers. <laughs> they were failures and were thus asked to leave. <laughs> they are to exist as the hunted, you see. What do you think? Um, should we be a snot or should we just go for damn it? Just give me my figurines already. <laughs> Actually, I'll tell you what, right? We, we, do, we tend to have a lot of decisions about this. How about we take the turns making decisions and let's see where chaos leads us. Sure. So I chose the last one. You chose this one. Um, I guess let's do what the hell are you babbling about? Let's be snotty. What are you talking about? Fool. <laughs> hmm. No need to look so concerned. Perhaps I should tell you a bit more about the synthesters. Good, you got it. <laughs> <laughs> synthesters are chosen beings, far cooler in an ironic sense. No, sorry, that's hipsters. <laughs> Superhumans who exceed ordinary humans in terms of motor reflexes and raw strength alike. To fulfill their own desires, they exert a truly unfathomable power. One could even say their potential is downright infinite. Mm. But we have a really, really silly name. I mean, look at mine. It's three question marks. It's just ridiculous, I tell you. <laughs> they said it was the only one they could give me. It's the only one left of the books. Everyone else is hard on a P for people. It's ridiculous, I tell you. No, no organization whatsoever. <laughs> but I digress. There is a catch, however. They have a certain weakness to the light of the sun. It is their Achilles... Heal. <laughs> you could almost think of them as man-made vampires, though without the unfortunate thirst for blood, of course. And, of course, the silly voices. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> vampires? Am I no longer human? Well, some would say I'm an otaku. Of course I'm no longer human. <laughs> Everyone else in the room has undergone this same metamorphosis into a, metamorphosis into a chosen being. They are the same as you. 
My turn. Hmm. Look, just give me the damn figurines. <laughs> Ellipsis. You came for a job, no? And that's all we want from you. Well, apart from a pint or two, but uh, hmm. I need some part-time help, and you newly born synthesters are just the ones to provide it. They don't drink blood, so what does he want a pint of? Put it back in your trousers. <laughs> Oops. Oh, it's nothing like what you're thinking, I'm sure. It's much, much worse. No, mm -hmm. it's a simple job. Something anyone can do, really. I want you to go to the news agents and find, buy me a packet of cigarettes. <laughs> oh, and a newspaper, if you wouldn't mind. <laughs> you're to attack the people wandering the streets of Akiba and see if they notice and absorb their life energy. Don't worry, it won't kill them. I simply wish to borrow that which gives them the will to carry on from day to day. Simply drain their life energy, and, and this is a bit of a monologue, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And Well, we're getting on to the comedy routine later on, it'd be fine. And bring <laughs> it back to us, and your job will be complete. Now we shall do some tap dancing. <laughs> and of course, you will be handsomely rewarded for your efforts. As much as you'd like will be yours for the taking. Treats. Your turn. Um, no figurines, no deal. Good night to you, sir. <laughs> With the wrong accent for that. No figurines, no deal. Good day to you. I said good day, sir. <laughs> hmm. You're as foolish as you look, it would seem. A pity, really. Well, the choice is yours. Just know this. Defective goods must be destroyed. <laughs> take, take off your mask. <laughs> oh, yes, sorry. Um, do you want to do a voice? Sure. Master Zanya, we have a situation. Can't you see I'm entertaining someone? What is the problem? I don't like the sound of that, and I finally have a name. Isn't that nice? Yes. What's wrong? <laughs> There's an intruder in the building right now. An intruder? What happened to the guards? <laughs> that. <laughs> oh, uh, her outfit's yeah. different in the thing. Yeah. Her outfit's the default one, by the looks of it. Yeah. Hmm. Um, so hard deciding on a voice. Uh, okay, well, five, four, not to put you under pressure, three, mm -hmm. two, one, go! Can you move? Can you talk faster? <laughs> Your turn. I thought I did the last oh, one. Oh, no, it's my turn, sorry, yes. Yeah. Um, uh, it's not hubba hubba, um... <laughs> Who are you? Follow me. We're getting out of here. I'm the person who ignores your questions. <laughs> God. My hair. If your hair's making you cough, that's worrying. <laughs> Subdue the intruder now. Yes, yes my, my master. master. <laughs> there are two of them. <laughs> <laughs> Right, doesn't look like we'll be able to get away so easily. We'll have to fight until an opportunity presents itself. I love the way that they did put the exit there, just so you know that uh, this is true. <laughs> You've got to get past them to the exit. <laughs> first things first, press the left button to uh, left bumper to enter combat mode. There oh, we yeah. go. Right, okay, oh, sorry, we're going to have to run through the tutorial here. Uh, I think we're going to have just about enough time to do this. Sure. Uh, okay, I'm going to create an opening for us to escape. Do your best to hold... Oh, actually, I think that's what you're saying. Oh. Do your best to hold them off in the meantime. Oh, go on, go on. Uh, do your best to hold them off in the meantime. Right. All right. Um, them yeah. <laughs> Basically, punch them until you can punch them no more. Yes. Yeah, wherever you've already ripped off the clothes. Yeah. Whoops. Get 
Try to fend them off. Try to fend them off. Try to fend them off. <laughs> this is beautiful though, you're like bouncing <laughs> off their heads. Of course combat isn't about hitting, you can also hold right bumps to block. Which I'm presuming we're gonna have to do until he pumps us. If the enemy is blocking your attack, push the, the left stick in the opposite direction while attacking to ensure uh, execute a special move. <coughs> yeah, and this is the reason why I loathe playing Street Fighter. You'll get it. No, I won't. Mm. Let's get out here a little bit. There we go. Alright. Yeah, come on! <laughs> What? Yes, that's very good. You have a greater sense for this night. Oh, good lord, that's worrying. <laughs> they basically just expected you to die. Now's our best chance. Move. Damn you. How dare you make light of us? Do you truly expect me to let you escape? So easily. Woof. <laughs> Your turn. Oh. Isn't it? Oh. You shielded me? Yes. And I'd better get laid for this. <laughs> are you alright? <laughs> Why are you still dressed? <laughs> Your turn. Um... I can't die yet. So much to live for. Men, surround them. Whatever you do, don't let them escape. And you, you at the back, take your shirt off while doing it. I was going to say, that's so douchey. <coughs> Three, two, one. Yes, yes my, my master. master. <laughs> I'm going for it. <laughs> Stay close behind me. I think we lost them. Okay, I think we are going to leave it there. We are, I think we're at about the 20 minute mark now. Yeah. <laughs> and if any of that made any sense to you whatsoever, you're mad, I tell you. You're it's not mad. our business to know what's happening in the game. Which is probably a good thing. Definitely. <laughs> yes. Why is it, I, I noticed that tree is wearing a bandage. It's it's uh, injured. Yeah, it's a terrible thing. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, okay, I think that's all we've got time for. So I'm going to say thank you, April, once again. This was wonderful. Oh, no, thank you. I had lots uh, of fun. <laughs> and um, we're going to be back here next week when we're going to struggle to try and actually understand what's going on with Little to no surrounds of success, I should imagine. So I, I hope you'll see us then. In the meantime, go and watch my stuff. Please give this a like, please subscribe, and then go and watch April's stuff, because it's fantastic. Thanks. <laughs> uh, especially the stuff with... No, no, all of it's fantastic. Especially <laughs> the stuff with me. No, all of it's fantastic. <laughs> so, until the next time, I've been Simon Parsons. This has been the wonderful Sims 3 Symbiote. Thank you, and good night. Bye.